Detroit's historic and premier artistic clubhouse is getting a new solo exhibit. It's opening tomorrow or run through November. Joining us to give us all the details is Catherine Diamond. Thanks a lot for coming in this morning. Thanks so much for having me. Now you already busted me, so I got to <laughs> ask you, for those of us who don't know what the Scarab Club is, why don't you tell us about it? I've not been down there yet. <laughs> uh, you are not alone. The Scarab Club is a 116-year-old club. Um, and it was originally started by artists and people who loved art and creativity in all its forms. So literary, performing, visual arts, all of them. And our clubhouse has been in our location on, in Midtown since 1928. So we're coming up on our 100th anniversary in our building. And it's a place for um, artistic exploration, exploration. So we have artists who are members, of course, but we also have people who just love the arts and creativity. We're open to the public. Um, and we really present a variety of programs for the public. And we'll talk about a few of them today, hopefully. We sure will. Well, let's get right to that. It's a great historic building you're in as well. So tell us about this new solo exhibit. Yeah, we have a great exhibition opening Friday. Um, it is a, um, a fantastic Latina artist. Her name is Nora Chapa Mendoza. She has um, been working, she was raised in, um, born in Texas, but raised in Michigan, raised in Detroit, and has been working in Detroit and in Michigan for her whole career. It is a re retrospective of her work, and we're super excited because she will be the first Latina woman to sign our famous beams. Having not been to the Scarab Club, you'll probably say, what do you mean beams? I'll tell you a little bit about them. Please. The Scarab Club has, um, has really the written history or the history of artists that have worked or come through Detroit literally signed on our beams in our historic lounge on the second floor. It was the members lounge, so people like Diego Rivera, uh, Marshall Fredericks, um, Marcel Duchamp, Norman Rockwell all wandered our halls and were invited to sign our beams. So their names are up there on the beams for all to see for the ages. That's so impressive names. It is, and Nora Chapa Mendoza is going to be our very first Latina woman to sign the beam. It is really a historic opportunity, um, and that will take place tomorrow night at 6.30. So um, we hope people come out to see that. Uh, now this uh, you know, exhibit has some significance and importance, and why is it important to show artists like this? Um, so artists like this are um, just, it, it shows the breadth of creativity in Detroit. And, and that have come through Detroit over time. It, her work is fantastic. It ranges from assemblages to um, watercolors to from abstract to highly realistic. Her work is just so dynamic. It really tells the story of her life. So by seeing her work in this way, you get to understand her 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 world and her viewpoint and where she where she came from and where she is today and it's it's a remarkable opportunity and there's so much going on at the scarab club i popped on your website the first thing i saw was like a haunted tour coming up tell us about that i mean it's the season yeah. for it yeah it is the season for it but the scarab club has long been known to have ghosts uh -oh. you know or think we have ghosts spirits spirits in the house so um, so we've decided to sort of um, really lean into that a little bit and get a paranormal group to come out and take a look at the club they'll be coming out next week to take a look and see what we have and we'll be having haunted tours on um, October 28th at the Scarab Club so man that's official you're getting the actual paranormal people to come out and find out if they're been through for real haunted <laughs> now if people want to go to the Scarab Club I mean how do they find you where do they get tickets for these events so the Scarab Club we have a, a website that has all of our ticketed events on it so the scarab club um, scarabclub.org on the website our Instagram is a great place to learn about things that are free and open to the public so for example next Tuesday we have a group of uh, the Detroit Literary Club that's coming in and they meet monthly and um, they'll be there uh, talking about and getting some um, some live, uh, what do you call it, open mics, mm. mic pre presentation. And then we have another series next week with um, Audra Kubat, who will be coming. She's a, a well-known um, uh, musician from Detroit, and she'll be here as part of our sound series next Thursday. And those are free and open to the public. So the Scarab Club is located in Midtown, right downtown, and um, we look forward to seeing you. Features local artists. It's a great uh, resource to have. And for people who haven't gone down there like me, let's get down there. Go great. visit Catherine. Thanks a lot for coming by today. Really Thanks for having me. That. Time for a quick break here on CBS News at 8. We're back with your headlines in a couple of minutes.